Lee, I believe we've got some very serious issues here. I believe that Jonah has some serious behavioural problems which are really impacting on the safe environment that we like to offer students in this school and I'm afraid it can't continue. A lot of students are very afraid of Jonah and what he'll do to them. I deal with Year 7s on a daily basis who are very afraid of him. Oh, shit. The fact here is you have threatened a teacher. I had Miss Wheatley in my office yesterday and she was very, very upset. She's a fucking liar. Jonah, oh. don't make it any worse, please. Threatening a teacher is an extremely serious business and we cannot tolerate it in this school. Mr Takalua, we believe there's no more we just that we can do for Jonah. Sorry, this. Margaret. No, no, um, you go on. We feel that it's time to ask Jonah to move on from Summer Heights High. Sorry to say that. Look, he's got no mother. Now I'm going to keep him on a rattling to calm him down a bit. So I'm really happy for him to stay here if you can allow him another one more chance. I, I'm sorry, I have to consider the safety of my staff. And it's, it's really beyond the point where we can look at making, you know, new changes or trying again. We do have to ask him to leave. We'll obviously try and find a school to transfer him to. And do you have any thoughts on the subject? Oh, I just have to send him back to Tonga to stay with his uncle. Right, well, that'll be a family decision, which clearly I'll have to leave you to make. Well, I guess that's it. Um, is there anything else that you want to say to us before you go? OK, well, um, you go and clean out your locker then. Mr Takalo, I'll have to ask you to stay here. I was starting to get worried. What's the excuse this time? Nothing, miss. You in trouble? No, miss. Okay, well, you can join us. We are playing spell attack. Okay, hey, what happened? Did so. you get busted again? No. It was nice, Nothing, sorry. Hands up straight in the air, remember that? Spell attack, elephant. Joni, you know this one. What about you? What's another word we could use in this sentence instead of outdoors? Just hold on there. We've got a visitor. Hey, Jana. Come on, mate. Come with me. I didn't say go to Gumnut Cottage. I said go and empty out your locker. Come on. Don't make a scene, Jonah. Get up out of the chair. Come with me. Come on. Jonah, get out. Fuck off! Fuck you! Fuck you, sir! Fuck you, sir! You're going to sit down, Leon. Sit down! Just calm down, Leon. Jonah, please, just go with me. 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 Then he got rich forever. The end. Well read, Leon. Thank you very much. Our next young reader is Ethan. It was a sunny on the day of the shooting. The kids were all busy working in the classroom. The first gunshot was heard from the science rooms where the year eights were working. The teacher, Mr. Jeffries, was freaked out. Look at you, Mr. Lewis, grab it one way. You hit a reader, huh? Yeah. Call out to the students. But if I get caught, I'll get caught. Get down. The girl screamed as they. There's just one more of my gunnut boys who's going to read for us today. This is a boy who's leaving us very soon to go back and live in Tonga. 
So, Jonah, thank you. Being a fob is mad because you are good at breakdancing. You are good at being tough. Teachers at this school are gay. All of, all of think think. Leon, do you want to go and help Jonah? Yeah. This. All of them. All of them think they know shit, but they don't. Except Mrs. Palmer, who is mad. And I am fully grateful for her for wasting her time with me. Now I can read and in Tonga I will read books every day. The end. Sir. Hey, I heard you're here today. Yeah. Just want to say good luck in Tonga, mate. Thanks, sir. Yeah. Pretty disappointed it hasn't worked out. Yeah, no worries, sir. Just one of those sort of square peg in a round hole situations, eh? Yeah. Uh, you're a good bloke, sir. <laughs> good on you there, mate. All right. Thanks, sir. Why the fuck are you being messed up? Stop it! Let's go, boys. Let's go. Fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, car. Come and get me, car. Come on. See that fucking driver? Get a sense of humor, car. Fuck you. Don't you even know what fun is?